for the rest of the month, we're talking about benefits and impact careers. Today, we're talking about one specific aspect of benefits, retirement plans, and why is it important? The estimates on how much money you need to retire, of course, varies by your expenses and where you live, but in the U.S., many experts say that you need at least a million to a million and a half dollars to retire at a comfortable level. Because pensions are becoming increasingly rare, that's a much bigger discussion. Employers will often provide between three to six percent retirement plans. This can be voluntary it match. If you put in 3%, they'll put in 3%. Not all employers do this matching. Some only give you the ability to open optional plans. It could be a 401k, a 403b. I've had positions where it's been small amount of matching up to 10% of my salary if I put in 3%. So that, you know, if I'm getting paid X amount of dollars, as long as I put in 3% of my salary, I'm getting 10% extra money every year to put away for retirement. In Kenny, the estimates is maybe you need 15 million Kenyan shillings for a comfortable retirement. The National Security Fund is mandatory but minimal. So making per personal savings or employer sponsored plans super important. In Brazil, some estimates you need up to 1 million real for a comfortable retirement. And there's public pensions, but there's often private and employer sponsored. So why is this all important? And again, as you start your career, whether in your 20s, 30s, or 40s, the idea is you don't want to have to work forever. Some people choose to work until they're 70, 80, but the dream for many people, if you want to keep working, great, but not to have to do at a financial necessity. Thinking about retirement, starting in your 20s, so if you have employer matching or you can put away for your own retirement, or both can make a huge difference. The earlier you start investing in your retirement, the longer your money or your investments can potentially grow. So when you're looking for impact jobs, particularly for full-time ones that you might be staying in for a couple of years, look at what are the retirement options. And usually employers will share this information with you once you get a final offer. It could be difficult to find this at the early stages. You can do some looking. What percentage they match, if any? Is it 2%, 3%? Is it only you've got to put in? Where does that money go? What type of plans do they offer? What are the fees? Talk to experts. Um, if you're interested, we offer a course on investing for social impact professionals on Maven. Our next one will be probably in early 2025. And this is the career tip of the day. Keep working for impact. Let us know your questions, tips, and thank you so much.